One person is in custody, a second is being sought in connection with a stabbing incident on September 21st. 22-year-old Tyler Pearson Hopped was arrested shortly after officers were called to a Cottonwood Drive address responding to a call of a stabbing. A male and female suspect fled the area prior to the arrival of the officers. Shortly thereafter, a second disturbance call in the 1700 block of Magnolia Drive led to Pearson Hopp's arrest. During the investigation by the Criminal Investigations Unit, it was determined that Pearson Hopped and 35-year-old Lake Havasu City resident Lauren A. Mayo unlawfully entered the victim's residence in the Cottonwood Drive address through an unlocked door. Pearson Hopped and Mayo were confronted by one of the residents. Pearson Hopped brandishing a small knife. A physical altercation between Pearson Hopped and the victim resulted in the victim being stabbed. He suffered non-life-threatening injuries. Pearson Hopped was charged with aggravated assault with a deadly weapon, assault, burglary, criminal damage, and disorderly conduct. He was held on a $250,000 bond during his initial appearance and transferred to the custody of the Mojave County Sheriff's Department. The Lake Havasu City Police Department is currently looking for Lauren A. Mayo. Anyone with information as to Mayo's whereabouts is asked to contact the police department. Anonymous information can be called into Lake Havasu Silent Witness. Citizens can utilize the police department's anonymous text messaging tip service by texting LHCPD and your message to crimes or 274637. Tips can also be submitted anonymously through a webpage-based tip service at www.tipsoft.com or via the Tip Submit mobile app. Jim Matthews, Havasu Video News.